Today we are going to show you how we do our stock helmet designs. What you do is you just take your normal simple helmet. As you can see this one already has graphics on it as one of our kits. Uh, we're just going to show you how easy it is to transform you know, an old design to a new design. As you can see I have the helmet all cleaned off, got the decals all taken off. Uh, cleaned it with the the, shampoo, the baby shampoo and water and then also alcoholed it that way it looks nice and clean as you can see the helmet looks almost back to brand new of how you would have bought it um, but yeah and then you got you know you got your waist that you took off just throw that away we're gonna work on HD 1083 as you can see kind of what this one's gonna look like again it comes with you know here's how it comes all the pieces to it Again, it's not taped, so that way it makes it easy to get put on. So yeah, take a look. So we got all the decals on. What you're gonna notice is that you got a lot of like hanging decals. What you gotta do is you actually gotta trim this part. Take a little X-Acto knife, uh, Make sure you get it pushed down really good, nice and tight up against any of the pieces you're gonna be trimming up against. Um, what this is gonna do is gonna clean it all up. So we're all done with HD 1083. Uh, as you can see, uh, it's got a really nice flow to it. Uh, it really kind of flows to the back that nice little kind of tailing that it does. Um, you kind of see the front, how that all kind of lines up. Same thing with the back, they all kind of come to the same point. Today we are working on a uh, box truck that's behind me here for uh, Office Innovations. Let's uh, check out how this goes. to uh, do the blacktop trucking LLC. Um, this is a, a brand new truck sitting behind me. Uh, I can't really see it too well in this picture, but I uh, uh, have the instruction on how to put it on. This is a, I wanna kinda hit on a, a point that we get asked a lot here at the shop. Um, you know, we ship a lot of stuff in boxes. We do installs, you know, we get it in a box just like you get it at home. So, you know, the difference is we obviously get the instructions how to put it on but you also get that with the proof. Um, so this is one of the concerns that we always get is, you know, I pull it out of the box, like so, and it, it's it got bins and all sorts of things that, that you think is wrong with it, which really it's not. It's, what happens is, is the tape itself is, um, is such a loose tape that it, it creates bubbles and stuff like that, which actually doesn't hurt you as much as you like to think it would. Um, but yeah, I mean, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show you that, you know, this is how it came straight out of the box. So you're going to watch me install it and you're not going to see any of the, the, you know, wrinkles and stuff like that. That's a lot comes with the installation part of it more than the, 
the actual, you know, hey, it came out of the box, it's got wrinkles and stuff to it. You know, because even on the back of this, it's, you know, it's pretty not very smooth, you know, it's pretty rough, but it's all in how it's, you know, packaged, which we loosely package it, meaning that we don't tightly wrap it around and uh, just to keep it so it's, it doesn't get that creases and stuff. Uh, but yeah, so take a look at this video. Um, you can see, got a truck behind me and we'll get started. Just finished up the install for uh, the Black Top Trucking Comp Trucking Inc. A um, couple things is when we're installing, uh, we always put both sides up and just to kind of see where things lie. Um, one of the big reasons why we do this is because if you have obstacles that you have to kind of go around on one side, whereas on the other side you don't have anything. So, like on this side, for example, the reason why I started on the passenger side was because. A, I have a, an antenna right here. So I originally, I always put numbers, you know, kind of up in this area. The reason for that is because, I mean, it's just where I put it. Well, since I know that the antenna is there, I actually drop it down, kind of center it with the Hemi, Hemi logo, kind of give it a nice look to it. Um, another thing you got to work with on, on Ram trucks is Rams love to put their, their verbiage right in the door, you know, Usually Silverado is more down here. You can kind of work around it. Dodges, it's kind of a, a just a fun game of trying to figure out where to put it. Um, but no, um, the overall install though was was fairly easy. Um, one thing I was gonna note is you know uh, when I showed you when it came out of the box, it had you know kind of the wrinkle effect, kind of where the tape looks like it's you know bubbling up in areas the backing looks bubbled as you can see i mean it turned out nice and smooth it's a lot to do with where you push your air when you're installing where to look for you know if it's going to wrinkle where you can kind of push that air to get it so it's out of your way um, another thing i did notice when i was installing is we do get asked this question a lot is uh you know the the, the paper wants to come up onto the vinyl that's normal um, a lot of this happens if uh, a vinyl has sat for too long and hasn't been used in maybe a month or two and it's just you know it it's just digging more and more into that paper which is i mean it's an easy way to get it off what you do is if you're pulling one way and it's sticking pull the other way see if it comes off that way if not you know you can kind of take your finger get the paper part off and you can see you know i had one section that's it's pretty you know pretty good i mean i can flick it that's that was what was sitting on one of my letters we get this a lot too with printed vinyls printed vinyls they're just a deeper cut that that they have to cut um to get through two layers of vinyl to you know the laminate then the vinyl but i mean overall it's it's fairly easy to work with you just got to take your time um especially if you start seeing that at first if you start seeing it right away you know realize that you're gonna have to take a little more time you know on, on your install um, but otherwise it will turn out just fine. I mean, you know, same thing with the paper. You can kind of see it's still crinkly, you know, from what, what I showed you earlier before. Uh, but otherwise the install went great. Um, nice clean look, brand new truck, looks amazing. 